What's up guys, this is Chronic Rush and welcome to episode 47, my FIFA 14 Rose Gold Around the World series. Welcome back guys. Uh, last episode we built, went out and um, played with the Ausk Avengers squad, picking up two wins. Uh, doing very, very well indeed. 2-1 win and a 3-1 win there. And uh, we're going to continue gunning, gunning on forward with this squad. Seems to be performing very, very well in the 3-4-1-2 formation, which I think is going to be very, very good performing um, formation in this game in general. So um, can't wait until using some more leagues, um, testing out that formation see how good it is uh give you some recommendation guys the series just show some entertainment and also help you guys um some of you may not be good players i'm not saying a number of you are absolutely fantastic i'm not saying i'm the best player you've ever seen in your life because i know i'm not um i make some most of the stupid mistakes sometimes i'm uh, should i say i'm just a bit of a newbie player sometimes when it comes to it but uh, sometimes it just seems to work other times it doesn't but come up against a false nine here four three three fifth version liga bva squad um sanchez via muayin isco song modlich marcelo miranda gordin um david alves D daniel alves sorry but uh, again, I thought it was coming back to that time where every single defection seemed to want to get in favour of my opposition. Uh, as you can see there, stupid defection falls in the path of the player, but he goes and keep a palms out in the 82nd minute. This is, and Will Miranda goes and wins a header there in the 84th minute. How frustrating can that possibly be? Losing, well, potentially losing the game in the 84th minute due to a corner which you conceded by an absolutely stupid defensive mistake. Well, not even that. Again, a thing that I could not control, which you'd probably never, ever see in real life. But uh, we go and lose the first game with the squad, only losing 1-0 um, with a stupid corner. OP Miranda's going to outjump any of my centre-backs there. Uh, goal rate centre-back's going to win every time. Um, he probably deserved the win. Uh, he had more possession, more shots on target. But I thought it was an even game. I thought it was doing fairly well defensively. He had some wild shots as well. So um, I wasn't too fussed about it. I was just annoyed that only losing 1-0, especially from a corner in the dying minutes of the game. But we're going to go straight back into the game. Confidence was still high. Still thought I could do fairly solid with this come. We're coming against a team called the Dream Team. Another French squad. Uh, Matuidi, Remy, uh, Griezmann, Ben Arthur, Pogba. Um, some very, very strong players on this game indeed. And in the third minute here, Remy here... Bad defence, and I thought this was not the time. And he goes and tucks that into the bottom left-hand corner to go and make that 1-0 in the fifth minute. And I didn't think this was the day. Um, everything, again, just seemed, didn't seem to be working. Um, that ball just seems to stay on that line for constantly. We do go and pick up a throw-in here. And I believe that is nine man's going to pick up this throw and have a quick throw in to the path of Heisen. Heisen into Moro here. Does some nice work. Unfortunately, that ball falls straight back out to his player, Matuidi, here. And um, I was doing quite well. A nice tackle from my player. And we're going to go on the attack here. Into the path of El Kabir. Nice dummy run there. Getting past the run of Sagna. Sacco comes inside. But we're going to be able to get across off into the path of Mayunga. Who's going to out-jump his centre-backs there to go and make that 1-1 one, one in the 29th minute. Move just before half-time here. Remy here doing some nice work. Um, had no really support on the left-hand side. So Griezmann goes and picks up that ball. But Moro here doing some nice defensive work. Unfortunately, she doesn't stop the supply of that cross here. Falls in to the path of my player. He goes and goes, and we're going to go on the attack, trying to pick up one goal just before halftime. Heisen here picks up the ball, does some nice work to get some free space. Sees the overtop run of Mob Beniki. Sees the through ball of Mayunga. Mayunga's going to finesse that into the top left-hand corner. Best place to pull it to make that 2-1 in the 45th minute. Move all the way to the 80th minute on the top ball into El Kabir. And uh, he gets brought down on the edge of the box. Um, definitely a red card there. If I had gone past him, that would have been a through ball. Um, through on goal. Koshi only picking up a red there. But uh, we're going to pick up the free kick. Borg is going to go and take that. But uh, I can't really do much for that close. But... Uh, El Kabir going to pick this ball straight back up, cuts inside, cuts inside again, cuts back inside, somehow keeps that ball around the keeper into the back of the net to go and make that 3, I think that's 3-1 now in the 89th minute. He then goes for a steaming run from his kickoff. Um, unfortunately, that was a foul there. And he goes for a quick, quick through ball from Valbuena into the path of Remy. No one was reading the ball whatsoever. And Remy's going to slot that into the back right-hand corner to go and make that 3-2 in the 90th minute there. And that was the end result. So picking up another win. That's three wins and one loss. Nine points in total. Um, coming back from 1-0 down in the fifth minute. Definitely showing the true characteristics of the squad there. Um, and uh, I was fairly happy about that. As you can see, there are loads more shots, even possession. Definitely deserved to win that game. And we did. So that's pretty happy about that one. Um, so we're going to back out of here and uh, hopefully we're going to go swiftly moving on. That definitely probably means we're out of the relegation zone. Um, only need one more point. I think uh, we got, I think we've played about 
four games now. So we've got six games remaining to go and pick up another 10 points, I want to say. I'm not too sure on how many points it requires to go and win the division. Um, but uh, we're going to go and pick up Swan Squad Fitness cards here. Um, the gold one still going for the same price as always. So uh, that's why I'm picking these up. 1,100 coins for a squad finish. It's cheaper than going out than buying individual cards. Um, so I just decided to go and throw that one onto the squad. Hopefully get and continue motoring on um, into this fairly successive season's run so far. Come against this squad here. FC Trogazilla. And he's going to have Neymar, Di Maria, L Villa, um, Matter. Some very, very high rated players indeed. Neymar up front being the real star of the show, should I say. Juan Matter over the top. Ball into the path of Neymar, the man Neymar, um, Neymar. Oh my God, Neymar and the man himself was just talking about. Neymar here cuts inside with a nice scoop done, goes for the shot here, past every single player into the back of the net to go and make that one nil in the third minute here. Always seems to be not ready for the game. Um, Straight from kickoff, I'm not too sure why, but in the 30th minute here, we're going to get a win. Um, we're going to win the ball from a corner. Unfortunately, pass out to the striker and lose it. We pick this ball up from a nice tackle, and uh, we're going to go on the attack here. Iboniki, a free ball into El Kabir. Gets fairly lucky for that touch to go around his charging centre back. One off the keeper. Keeper palms that straight back out, but he's going to fall to the path of El Kabir here. Force the path of Heisen. He's going to finesse that round the keeper to go and make that 1 1 in the 33rd minute there. Moving to the 38th minute here. Unfortunately, Molo doesn't get lucky there, and um, the ball just doesn't fall into his path. Uh, but a nice tackle from Heisen, doing defensive work as well, waiting for the run over the top ball into Igbon and Niki. Nice, nice touch to get around all his players. He's got the 92 pace to get around everyone, and blast that top right-hand corner to go and make that 2-1 in the 41st minute there. Move just into the second half here, straight from um, heart kickoff, sorry. El Kabir here, unfortunately loses the ball, try to go for a steaming run down there. Uh, but uh, we're going to get a nice interception Interception from Heisen again doing defensive work. But uh, really should have tried that skill move there. And he's going to be on through over the top ball into the path. I believe that is Aubameyang. And I think he made a couple of substitutes at half time. And Aubameyang is going to go and slot that in. To go and make that 2-2 in the 48th minute. Move to the 60 minute mark here. And uh, we go for a nice shot. Unfortunately that gets put out for a corner. Um, kind of surprise shot on the keeper. was the only thing he possibly could do. Ricardinho swings this bad boy in onto the head of Heisen. Falls into the path of Borges. Who's going to cut inside. Unfortunately gets tackled from Cesc Fabregas. And uh, deflection there. Unfortunately couldn't win that interception. He's going to go on the counter attack here. Got plenty of players back though. Unfortunately... Make the worst of that sliding tackle over the top ball into his player. I tried my best, but that falls onto the path of Jesus Navas. He's going to smack that into the roof of the net to go and make that 3 2. Then moves into the 76th minute over the top ball into his player. Uh, Casillas, he's going to be passing it around the back into his player, into Di Maria here. And um, he's just passing around, trying to contain possession. Uh, I do believe we eventually go and get this ball back anytime soon and uh, we're going to go take over the top run into the path of El Kabir. Sergio Ramos tried sliding up over the top ball and a chip to go and make that 3-3 in the 79th minute here move it all the way into the 90th minute here one added minute and um, all I had to do was defend it and see the game off but uh, play kind of got surrounded and everything was happening and I believe Aubameyang goes and slots that in in the 90th minute to go and make that 4-3. Which is a very, very, very frustrating indeed. I, I was pretty pissed off about that one. But uh, you just have to pull it by the side. Especially scoring in the 90th minute. That's FIFA for you guys. FIFA makes me rage in most any other game. Because of stupid things or just not lasting out until the final whistle. Um, but uh, that's like in football as well. You never know what's going to happen. It's such an unpredictable game. As you can see there, fairly even possession. I had a bit more shots than them. So I'm not too sure um, if the final end result led to the final score. Um, but um, it doesn't really matter. We're gonna, we've still got plenty of games to go and at least get promoted. Um, the main goal is to go and win the title of this. But as you can see there, we've got quite a few players with one contract remaining. So that means next episode, we're going to have to go and pick up a shit ton of contracts, which I'm going to be doing now. Just picking up silver ones. I'm um, sorry, gold ones for 200. Go and pick them up for 200. As you can see, they get 11 silver contracts out of, um, for 200 coins, uh, which these were things were going like hotcakes. Um, absolutely going so far. So uh, I, man I managed to get still a couple. Got about six there. Just going to apply them onto the players. So we're all ready for the next episode. Uh, to get straight back into the games, keep the momentum going, hopefully go and continue on winning. And get closer and closer to that promotion zone. 
But uh, guys, it's coming to the end of this episode. The Alex Kavenskan squad seems to be fantastic. Well, 4-3-1, two formations seems to be very, very solid indeed. Depending on the positions you choose players, make sure you choose fairly solid sentiments and decent work rates as well. I feel work rates are becoming more beneficial in this game. But guys, this is the end of the episode. If you like so, remember to that button. Also, subscribe to the series. And any feedback in the comments would be appreciated, guys. This has been Crush. Till next time, adios.